let's do an exercise to explore the API a little bit more. What I want to do is rather than me saving all the features to my disk, I want to be able to select certain features. So I, I will select certain features. And when I run the script, it should only save the attributes of the selected features. Yeah. Vigna, you can explain the exercise. Yeah, uh, so we just want to uh, get attributes of selected features. So uh, in uh, QGIS vector layers, we have few methods from which you can just get selected features. You can count number of selected features. You can get IDs of se selected features. So you can explore these methods and uh, you have to make changes mostly here where you are getting all the features you will have to get the selected features apart from this uh we already have some conditions right like, like whether this is a vector layer or not whether there is any active layer uh present or not like this you have to add one more check uh for this one you have to add uh line to count selected features and say uh, whether there there are any features selected in the active layer or not so uh, the a code should work if uh, there are any selected features in your active layer. Uh, otherwise, it should give the error message. So uh, just try this one. Uh, from here, you can get uh, you can do the uh, run where you can just uh, get the selected features rather than all the features. And we have a method to count. So here you can go and you can find the method to count the selected features and see whether the count is zero or not. If it is zero, it should give the message. 